the changes, and it starts tonight. Yeah. Sam's here to tell us uh, what exactly is coming our way. A little snow coming Ooh. in tonight. I know. <laughs> this time of the year, I can't win. I'll give you good news. Then I have to give you some bad news generally, but uh, you know this is uh, this is good. We're easing into uh, March here. It hasn't been too bad. I know it's only day two, but <laughs> March is uh, always an interesting month, and in this case, interesting means rain and snow coming in this evening. Right now, things are pretty quiet, but if you look off to our north, up into uh, northern Michigan and into Ontario as well, you can see some snow showers this is going to be a gradual um, arrival of this rain and it will mix with and then change to snow after 9 p.m. So it's late that we get our snow and it doesn't hang around long. The system snow ends by three in the morning. So if you're like me and you go to bed super early, even if you get up pretty early in the morning, you're going to sleep through this. But we have some light lake effect that's going to develop in the morning. So you'll want to be sure that you're tuned in to Jeff first thing tomorrow morning as he'll be tracking any lake effect we have in the area. I'm going to give you a caution light for the morning commute just because I do think we'll see at least a little snow out there. Some slick spots for sure. And you want to give yourself time to clean off your car if you park outdoors because we will see some light accumulation with this. But we are also going to see a big thaw this weekend, and I can't wait to tell you about that. We'll talk about that coming up in just a bit.